Bay Point, real estate market update for Panama City Beach, Florida. It's August, so let's see what's happened the last 30 days. I'm Sean Casilli with Coldwell Banker Realty here in Panama City Beach, Florida, and welcome back to the YouTube channel, Bay Real Experts, where we aim to educate you on the market of real estate so your next move can be smart. All right, you guys, let's jump straight into the numbers of this market report of Bay Point. We're going to be taking a look at what happened in July, and let's see what's on track for August 2020 for Bay Point, Panama City Beach, Florida. So to kick things off, we had in June, we had 35 active listings on my last report, if you want to watch that here, to make some comparisons of July's numbers, we dropped down to 32 active listings as of today with price ranges between 145,000 and that's going to be for an attached uh, unit versus a list price that we have on an active listing of 2.2 million. If you want to see my listing there and how we do marketing of it, you can check it out here. As far as new listings between June and July, we dropped again from 13 down to eight new listings in July. There is a shortage of inventory. There's lots of buyers in the market. So if you're thinking about selling your property, please give us a call. In June, we had 14 properties under contract at the time of our report. At the time of this report from July, we had 13 properties under contract in Bay Point. Number of properties sold in June in Bay Point, there were 13 that closed. Whereas in July, up till today, this is in now just in the beginning of August, we had eight properties sell with a price range between 97,000 to 2.130 million. Average selling price in Bay Point for the month of July was 297,953. Now don't get too attached to that number if you think that your property is um, maybe on the lower end or on the extreme high end of luxury. This is just an average and it's taking into consideration everything across all price points within Bay Point. Panama City Beach, Florida. If you guys are watching this from another subdivision and you're interested in getting a market report for your subdivision, please leave a comment below and let me know and I will try to get around to that. If you like this type of content, please give me a thumbs up. It really does help the channel. And don't forget to hit the subscribe button down below because you don't wanna miss out on any market reports or any of our listings or anything else real estate news related in Panama City Beach, Florida. And I will talk to you guys on the next one. But in the meantime, stay safe, stay healthy, and stay positive, you guys. I'm Sean Casilli with Coldwell Banker Realty, and I will talk to you on the next one. Bye for now.